similar to the other um, test script, start out by having the user double click on the icon and then on the main screen um, have them just specify by selecting the three data sets this is from the previous test script and then make sure that the output file is define XML and then click on the generate button um, so once the uh, generate button is clicked um, oh I guess part of it is why don't you have a step where the user clicks on the edit button and then they click on the refresh to make sure that everything is refreshed and click on OK and then after that um, click on OK and then uh, make sure that the output file is defined and then click on generate now in this case um, the verification is to look at the output file when it gets created which is the XML file here and in this example let me resize here um, have the user verify the fact that if they scroll down to the race variable which is similar to what we had before uh, now I don't see the race variable anymore uh, sorry I had it mm, okay let me go back actually in the previous step I have the user click on the edit button and then have the user scroll over like we did before to the value level metadata and then have them go down to the race variable and then um, which I don't see anymore let's see actually just have the user select on a new variable in this case which is the uh, ex TRT treats and then type in the value yes and then click on OK. Now they can then click on the generate button and then the verification is for the user to review the actual XML output file. So if they were to scroll down to the or click on the EX data set and then cl click on the EXTRT which is the one that we created and then um, the verification is that there is an go back to index link here so when they click on that it jumps back to the very top so that's all the verification is mainly that is if the user clicks on the um, value level metadata link and then that there is a go to index and when they click on it it goes back to the top index list